In a truly globalised sporting world, the continued progress and growth of any sport is more and more reliant on the partners and sponsors that support it. Well, dressage really blends with my uh, aesthetic, my brand. It's all about uh, harmony between, uh, you know, two people or harmony between, an, you know, a horse and a, a human being. I think it's just so exciting. It it's just says the same message as being married. This is like being married to, uh, to you know, perform something so beautiful. In equestrian sport, the FEI and its first top partner in a record multi-million euro deal are about to celebrate their first anniversary. And the global partnership is already seeing positive development on the ground. It may have been a huge international deal, but the values of equestrian sport that affect so many ordinary people also affect those making these international agreements. Like so many parents, Walter von Canel has a daughter who loved to ride as a child. As old father, we were so proud to go with her to the regional uh, competition and getting nervous and had to use uh, uh, our, our good father spirit to say, oh, keep quiet, you did well, but next time it will be better. <laughs> See, so we went through this period too. Our commitment in sport has long history. It started in 1878, Olympic Games 1896, etc., etc. The riding 1881 of the state, and step by step we expanded and we reduced. Uh, in 97 we decided to focus on elegance and we get rid of all non-elegant sport and we focus equestrians, uh, ski, gymnastic, and uh, later on we get into Roland Garros. So equestrians is for us the perfect match of elegance and attitude. I think it's uh, the blend of the music and the, again it's the harmony between uh, the horse and the, the, the rider and uh, I love dancing. I am uh, I used to dance, ballroom dancing and I, I relate to this so much and uh, it's just so romantic at the same time so it's everything I really look forward to seeing. And equestrian is not only one, it's a couple between the horse and the rider. And I think uh, 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 this is definitely matching our policy. Thanks to FEI and uh, uh, on the horse jumping, it's our main activities. I think we have over 120 different races, but it's our life. Equestrian sport has grown into a global community alongside the technology and science that has fueled globalization generally. With the sport growing on all continents and with an increasing will from the federation that controls the sport to bring all equestrians into the family, there is a need for global partners that reflect the same goals. FEI is the body in horses. FEI has the respect of everybody. FEI has experience. And with FEI horses experience, we will be both great winners for the horse sport. This year has already seen a fantastic FEI World Cup Finals in Lyon. Every horse and rider combination qualified in leagues around the globe to be there, reflecting in starting lineups where riders from 20 nations competed for the jumping title and 11 nations for the dressage title. Later in the summer, all the world's equestrian nations will gather to compete for gold in all FEI disciplines at the Alltech FEI World Equestrian Games in Normandy. This is a sport at the top of its game and alongside all other sporting successes, needs partners with the same values to move forward to a successful future. China is far number one country for me. I just came back from Chengdu last week. We had the first race we, we could import temporarily within two weeks, 51 horses from Dubai. So uh, things are moving in the right direction. So I'm sure if we look the beginning, the three, four months, again, we'll have a great year, the year of the horse.
Finally, we signed this great agreement and we are more and more committed worldwide. So I will hope that one day everybody agrees that horse riding is Longines, NFEI.